Hello, this is Dion Black from Let's Talk Sex.net and today we are going to review the Flashlight V-Stroker Adapter. If you guys have watched my previous reviews of Flashlight, I have received both Flashlight Flight, Flashlight Ice and the Flashlight V-Stroker in the same anonymous boring box with the, which doesn't say anywhere this is a flashlight which doesn't say anywhere this is uh, this contains male masturbators pocket pussy or nothing it's a totally plain totally anonymous box totally anonymous and plain box let me tell this again in case it wasn't clear I'm gonna go ahead now and uh, try the flashlight V-Stroker I have never tried virtual sex before so I'm so curious to see how this is gonna work okay guys so this is the flashlight V-Stroker outside its box very easy there are no many parts you got the adapter itself which you can open here you see and uh, it's, you have put a batteries in here it comes already with some uh, spare batteries so you can already put the batteries in here this is, you see, you open, put the batteries then you use the adapter and then you screw it inside your flashlight I think they put a double layer just to protect the batteries, you know so that this part here can even get dirty uh, and you can wash it but the batteries are protected which is very smart uh, this is the USB thing that you plug in your computer and I'm gonna do it now, I'm gonna see uh, what you get and uh, well, I guess this is a bonus here for um, live cams to connect with lab girls and stuff and um, yeah some instructions, some sample lube that's it so let's plug it in alright guys so I've mounted the V-Stroker this is the V-Stroker adapter just at the bottom of my flashlight eyes and this is the V-Stroker USB key plugged in now when you get the V-Stroker you also get uh, a leaflet Right, that gives you a link where you can download the videos, the video, the free videos um, to play with the V-Stroke and the free interactive virtual sex videos. I have downloaded one, I have downloaded the Victoria Ray one, and now I'm gonna press play and show you how this works. It's very cool, and uh, you guys gotta take a look at this. All right, now we start with the intro. Here we go. Now, these are the instructions to use the V-Stroker. It's not that you really need many instructions. I mean, it's pretty intuitive, but you, go, uh, you can basically use the keyboard or the buttons in order to um, change the sexual scene uh, in which you will be having virtual sex with the model and uh, and yeah, there are instructions related to the sensitivity and the like I'm gonna press play now and show you um, I'm gonna press click to continue and I'm gonna show you the things here we go, here she comes Hi. Nice. Hi. so I'm gonna stop because um, it's not necessary for me to show you the video you will enjoy much more when you will have it on your own computer this is it here you can choose the sensitivity you can you see it? sensitivity here basically regulate the responsiveness of a V-stroker to your movements this instead here next there is max speed can you see max speed? right max speed here gets the model to um, to basically get wild and uh, this is the play button, instructions button, volume and here you can choose the different scenes you see from 1 to 9 and 0 is the climax scene so I've done this earlier and uh, well guys it's really cool as you shake the V-Stroker uh, as you shake it, as you uh, thrust inside it the model uh, interacts with it it re also she keeps looking in the camera that really m it makes you feel like she's really here wi with you and uh, yeah well it's it's actually very very <laughs> I didn't think virtual sex could feel so real um, 
then you keep going, change the scene, she changes position, doggy style, uh, whatever, uh, on top, or all our sex, and whatever, and, uh, and then you choose when to climax. It's actually really, really cool. I did know the uh, visual sex could be exciting, but I didn't think it was gonna be this much exciting. When you're done, you can easily dismount the v stroker here, and thanks to the double layer, you can just wash this part here, uh, the top part, of course, uh, the one closer to the to the flashlight itself, and uh, let it dry, and, uh, and then you're ready to go.